So I'm surviving part of this winter 19, uh, 2023 here in, uh, I'm in Germany here. I'm hardly getting out of this room here. Oh, been here more than a month all the time in this room. And, uh, you know, my legs are still pretty bad, you know. And uh, so I'm next to the Polish border. It's um, November. Uh, people have been seeing wolves here. And uh, there was a lynx in the garden. This is called, uh, it's called here Brandenburg. Next to a place called uh, Cottbus. <clears throat> yeah. So I'm working for you. I'm just working, working, working. So here I got some rye crackers. And look at the logo. You know, there's a crown for the nobility. And then on the crown there are like three fleurs de lis. For the concept of three, which is them. The old world's order. And to the left and all the way to the right... If you put them together, we got the, the fourth one, which is the concept of four, which stands for us. But we are like in half, like we're not like entirely persons for them, you know. And there are four letters, and on one letter only, the S is the crown. So it does also say in the letters the concept of three and four. Because altogether four letters, and if you take, if you t the, the the one on the S is the S is accentuated, so it sort of leaves you know without the S another three letters. And there's blue for the war in it, and the yellow might stand for the uh, for the white. So this is rye, some rye crackers, very nice. So here you got this beer here. It says uh, from 1732, like uh, a monk's beer. You know, why do they put the G here? You know. Yeah. Well, the name is uh, G Gerardus, and uh, but they always put the G. You know, whenever they can, they put the G there. You know, as in a, as in a. Freemason Lodge. It's uh, 7%. So quite a good beer. Really nice. A double one. Double what? Yeah. So the G in between the square and compass. It says here one more time here. Why is it so important for them? So I didn't look in my mail for almost three months from October to uh, uh, 2023. Now it's the, uh, it's the 2nd of January 2024. So it's amazing. It's, I've got 345 mails. I have no idea how I'm going to get through all this. We see it's mail after mail after mail after mail after mail. It will take me it will take me three days, you know. It's amazing. Why does it work? Yeah, it's amazing. I don't even know who all these people are, you know. Many pages. Three hundred and forty five. Hmm. Three, four, five males on my Swiss torture. So here I'm again. It's another place here in France that a Yugoslav guy who took me hitchhiking once and uh, yeah I, I, I get along well with Yugoslav people you know because they are they don't make like Easy-going people, they've got a lot of humor, they like playing chess. 
and they don't make any problems, you know, they just, they don't care about problems, sort of, you know, and I, yeah, I heard the Yugoslav, you know, during the uh, Pharaoh's, um, uh, Pharaoh's poison and everything, you know, 2020 and 2019, uh, they just got rid of their own government, they just said, uh, the government said, we want to lock you in, and apparently they said, well, we're going to lock you in, get rid of it, you know. And of course, there was no story about this in any newspaper, you know, because, you know, uh, they probably were afraid other peoples would do the same thing. Yeah, so, yeah, so I'm just staying here for a couple of days. So it's always the roundabouts, you know. You see, it's, it seems to be like Christmas, you know, some packages. Which is a square, there's a lot of squares in it. And here the, uh, the round balls here. It's for the circle, the, uh, the compass. And there are four balls for the concept of four, and one of the balls is the concept of three. It stands for the compass. Which normally, there's only the four balls, but now, okay, it was um, like Christmas, still hanging around here. So it's definitely square, you know, even a square the cross in the middle on it and these ones there it stands for the compass so it says square and compass it's always on the roundabouts